All right, guys, welcome to Collectible Motor Car of Atlanta. My name is Chris, I'm the manager here, and today is our second episode of Coffee with Collectible. So go ahead and grab your cup of coffee and walk with us. All right, guys, so we got some new inventory in, got some really cool new pieces, as well as some pieces that y'all saw in the last episode that we've already sold. So I know I showed you the 1970 Chevelle. This car is actually going to a dealer uh, Chevrolet dealer up in Pennsylvania. Uh, Mr. Dell is going to love this car. LS1 powered, UMI suspension, beautiful car. Uh, as we walk over here, I'll show you some of the other cars that we probably got in, I think, before. I think I showed you guys all the trucks and stuff that we had. Uh, this is kind of our resto mod section here. Uh, we've got a beautiful 1967 Chevelle, butternut yellow. It's got some nice 18 inch um, resto mod type wheels on it. Really looks good. We've got my OBS over here in the corner. I really want to uh, talk a little bit about this truck here. Um, I think you guys seen it in the last video. I talked about it. It's got a 496 big block in it. Um, it's got a ton of power, very high quality build. As some of you remember the other rims that were on there, they, they were not the greatest wheels. So uh, I found these wheels online. We used our fitment tool to get the exact fitment on there. And I ordered these 20 inch rocket wheels for it. And they really, really look good. Uh, we've got to replace the wheel studs on the back side there because the other wheels had spacers and they had to cut the studs. So my mechanic's going to have to put new studs on it. But once we get this all finished and get it back down on the ground and get the stance right, this will be one bad truck. But super beautiful truck, 1956, 3100. I uh, want to show you another cool car that we just got in. This is an awesome 2008 Bullet Mustang. So a lot of you guys that might be a little older, I'm sure y'all saw the movie Bullet that had Steve McQueen in it, had that famous uh, chase scene in there. Uh, Ford come out with this car in 2008 to pay tribute to that. Um, they also recently just came out with another Bullet Mustang, I think in 2019 or 2020, that is green. Um, these cars come in green and black. This one is green, and this one has 3,000 miles on it, guys. So it's literally like brand new. Five-speed manual. It's got the 4.6 liter. V8 underneath the hood, just a really cool car. And this is a car that you could buy and sit on it for a couple years and it's gonna do nothing but climb in value. Super cool car. Let's go ahead and walk this way, guys. Trying to show stuff that you probably haven't seen. We went over the Corvette aisle here last time. Um, one of our customers here bought this beautiful K10. Super nice truck, it's got a ton of documentation on it. Justin sold this beautiful Ferrari a gentleman out of California. Um, Justin, his niche is a little bit better on these exotics. I don't really know a ton about them. Justin's got a pretty good knowledge on these. So he sold this to a gentleman in California. We also sold the 2023 Porsche 911 Targa. This is a really cool car as well. I sold this to a gentleman out of Florida. He's actually surprising his wife with it. So super cool gift. Uh, we also got an awesome 1970 uh, Jimmy with a 5.3 Vortec motor in it. Super cool. This truck was built for a famous person. We can't actually disclose who it is, but a famous country singer uh, had this truck built and no longer needs the truck, so it was brought to us to sell. But it's super cool. It's got a, about a four inch lift on it. It's got the LS motor in it. It's got a, a four speed manual transmission. Just overall, really cool truck, really nice paint. It's in really, really good condition. It's got a really nice stereo system in it overall just just really nice uh, let's go ahead and walk back this way we'll we'll make mention of this truck too this is a what was this an 03 03 chevrolet it's got an ls3 in it custom interior it's like a, a dark brown leather interior super nice truck it's got a wood bed in the back super cool truck pretty fast too we also just got this beautiful Beetle in. I believe it's a 72 Beetle, Super Beetle. I really like the orange on this one. We've got a few things we need to do to it. We're gonna get it, get it buffed and get the uh, front bumpers and rear bumper swapped out on it. Probably out of all the cars that are in our showroom right now, I'm gonna say this one's probably my favorite. This is a 1968 Chevrolet Camaro Resto Mod. It's got the RS hideaway headlights with the Z28 stripes on it, hugger orange, custom interior. It's got uh, heights, independent rear suspension, 
Just a super cool car. The fit and finish on this car is very nice. Just an all, all around, very nice driver and show car. Super cool. Really love this body style of Camaro. Uh, Justin, if you'll go ahead and just turn back around real quick and, and show him that beautiful F-250. This is a really, really clean F-250 we just got in. I believe it's a 78. Um, it's got the 400 Ford uh, big block in it. It's got the C6 transmission. It's got a really nice bin, uh, bin. It's got a really nice brown uh, leather bench seat in there that just really ties in good with this green metallic paint. And guys, it doesn't, doesn't do it any justice on camera. This truck is a nut and bolt restoration. I mean, it's absolutely beautiful. When I was looking over it, I was actually having a hard time telling if it was original paint or if it had been repainted. Um, after looking over it really, really good, I was able to tell that it was a repaint. Um, but they, whoever did it did an excellent job. I mean, every, every bolt and nut came out of it and was painted. All the trim came off when they painted it. I mean, they did it right. It's super, super nice. We also, we're not gonna show too much of this car cause I'll let Justin just pan over real quick and pan back. Cause we're gonna do some uh, modifications to this car, but we just got a really nice, uh, another really nice 68. Camaro. Actually, this is a, the Hugger Orange was a 67. I'm sorry, I said 68. It's got the wing window, so it's a 67. But it got a really nice 68 uh, Camaro that we just got in. And that one, we're going to be doing some modifications to it. So that'll be a video on its own that you'll be catching on the channel here soon. Uh, another two Mustangs that we got in, we got a really nice uh, 1970 True Mach 1 with a second gen Coyote. This car is already sold, didn't even last, what, a week, two weeks. Super nice car. It's got nice Willwood brakes all the way around. It's got interior out of like a 2014 Mustang in there. Just super cool car. Also had this beautiful 1968 Mustang Coupe. This one's got a built 302 underneath the hood. It's got disc brakes, Dakota digital gauges. Just a really cool car. We haven't actually gotten pictures of this one yet. It's on the website, but it's marked coming soon. So you guys are getting the first look of this one, but brand new inventory here. Also want to mention that we sold the 1997 Cobra with the Coyote motor. This one didn't last very long either. This is a very unique car. The gentleman that owns this car has dumped tons and tons of money into this car. And it's a, it's a pretty nice one. This car is actually staying in Atlanta. We got a local gentleman that bought it. But guys, that's just about it. That's pretty much all we got going on with new inventory. Uh, we've got a few other things that are planning on coming in within the next week. So tune in for the next episode and we'll have new inventory to show you guys. But till then, we'll catch you next time.